welcome to another video of uh, mrlopezclasse.com we are going to complete the part number two of the video about the corrosion the corrosion in a sea ray in a sun dancer you remember this boat <coughs> exactly uh, we did the part number one we discovered some issues about corrosion and uh, today we are going to start with the second part remember guys that uh, we need install a galvanic isolator here uh, the boat doesn't have this is the cable uh, this is the short power the short power cable this is the drum to collect the cable and uh, the cable enter here in a, in a, in the chore 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 breakers uh, but um, no galvanic isolator is installed here we are going to install today the galvanic isolator we are going to open that box we are going to verify where is the ground and how we are going to connect probably here in this area um, the galvanic isolator okay we are going to start opening this box uh, okay guys we are going to check uh, what is the where is the ground okay you see Danny the ground was interrupted to install the ice the galvanic isolator outside but they never install the isolator they connect again that Mickey Mouse connection and they they send the ground inside this we, we need to cut it again and extend those cables outside to install probably here the galvanic isolator. <laughs> see, you see? This boat doesn't have galvanic isolator. Originally, they interrupt the cable to install the galvanic isolator over there, but they never install. We are going to cut it here, cut it here, and we are going to extend those cables. We are going to make a hole here to install the galvanic isolator over there. Okay, guys, this is uh, where we are going to connect the galvanic isolator those are the green cables this is the breaker for 240 and this is the breaker for uh, 120 single phase and double phase uh, we are going to connect both of them together and uh, this one those cables are coming here from the short power this one will be the input and from the output we are going to enter here and connect here we are going to enter here and connect both of them here. This is and this is the the input to the AC panel. Uh, this is uh, approximated the result. Uh, those are the grounds coming in into the boat, and uh, those are the grounds coming from uh, the short power. Okay, and uh, we have a uh, one ground entering in the isolator transform in the galvanic isolator and other ground that uh, will be connected here entering into the boat and uh, this is the new position for the galvanic isolator we are going to organize the cables and later we are going to show the final result okay guys this is the final installation of uh, the galvanic isolator the galvanic isolator the capacity in arm is according with the capacity of the main breaker in arm uh, this is uh, one of the parts of the process now we are going to check the connection in between the bonding conductor and the sacrificial anode 